Hey everybody, I wanted to do another video on this uh, new memory here. Uh, one of the toughest tests to run is the vanilla version of The Last of Us and it's shader compile. This is always one of the toughest things, uh, but not just that. Uh, this is the uh, G-Skill uh, DDR5 48 gigabyte kit that is the 7200 megahertz. Uh, right now it is at uh, 8200 megahertz and I'm running uh, case latency 40 at 1.35 volts. Yes, 1.35 volts, guys. Uh, let me see if I can get my memory speed up here on this. There we go. Uh, so we're running uh, 8200 uh, with just the uh, normal 8,000 timings. And uh, you can actually see that voltage there, 1.35, and we're doing that. Uh, com that shader shader compile for the last of us. Uh, this is this is always a great great test um, This kit's already stable. I've already ran it through everything. So I'm just getting it through some stuff now testing out 8200 on air cooling. Yep with just a fan uh, This is on the Z790 Apex. These sticks are just insane guys 1.35 volts with 8200 megahertz right here I mean, look at these things. See my RAM temps? All right, so we're hitting like 32, 32.8 Celsius. Uh, these things run very cool too, by the way. Um, the CPU is at six gigahertz and 4.6 on the E cores. And of course, 5.1 ring. Uh, but yes, these are some really, really nice RAM. Um, so many people say, hey, they're the same thing as the 8,000 sticks. And again, these are 7,200 sticks, guys. So I'm just kind of getting into uh, scratching the surface on these a little bit. And I just wanted to show this off. 8,200, 1.35 volts on air cooling. And uh, hey, I got more room to go, guys, okay? Uh, so uh, anyways, uh, thanks for watching. And uh, keep you guys updated on some future overclocking with these. Thanks.